everyone, Miss Patsy here at Castile Innovation Lab, and I just wanted to show you really quick. Um, I know our fourth graders are studying earthquakes, and um, so I thought I would show you how to make a simple earthquake um, table. And all I did was took a box. Um, this was from a box of printer paper, and I took the top and I cut out a smaller cardboard sheet, and I filled my box with marbles to provide the shaking. And I put the cardboard, um, the smaller cardboard on top. And we have some Lego buildings that you can build. Um, make, you can make them different um, heights and widths and just shake away. To see what effect an earthquake might have on your building. I have a taller building here with a heavier top. And you can see that um, taller buildings with, um, with their uh, center of gravity higher tends to tip over uh, faster than if your center of gravity is lower for, and for stronger and um, shorter buildings. It's a fun activity to do at home. You can make yourself an earthquake table, build some Lego buildings, and see how they would fare in an earthquake. Thanks, and see you next time.